And up first at 530 tonight, this man is behind bars after a shooting left a police officer and two other victims hospitalized. Our Jonathan Coto has been following the story and has the details on this scary incident in a Seguin neighborhood. A wild early morning in a normally quiet Seguin neighborhood, a Seguin police officer shot along with a woman and child. And all after a call for domestic trouble. It doesn't happen too often, but it does happen. It's, this neighborhood is just like any other neighborhood, especially when it comes to domestic violence, because there's, there's no control over that. And it was exactly reports of a domestic disturbance that led officers to this scene. Maris Hernandez says she had just arrived at home when she and her brother heard shots after shots being fired. Mm, I was like, just close the door. I was like, don't just stay inside or whatever. And I had um, looked outside and I had seen all the cops and I was like, oh my did something bad. The Seguin Police Department quickly taking to social media, alerting people in that area of the active situation and asking residents to shelter in place. Police say after arriving on scene, they found one of their own shot, they say, by 56-year-old Rodney Juarez. The same man, police say, also shot a woman and a child. Janie Hernandez says she's in shock and disbelief that this took place just feet away from her home. We were informed that an officer was shot. So for one of our officers to be shot, it's a shocking because we don't have this here in Seguin. Seguin police say Juarez was arrested and is facing three counts of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. The Seguin police officer as well as the two other victims were taken to San Antonio hospitals and are expected to be okay. This case remains under investigation. We'll update you as more information is made available. Reporting from Seguin, Jonathan Cotto, KSAT 12 News.